the frick is going on, guys? I'm back at it, baby. Follow me on TikTok, I smell like Penny. You already know that. You already did that. You already saw that. You already do what I do what I defeated. Yes, sir, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Oh, yes, Today's white bird. Today's whiteboard word of the day. The ghetto. Oh, ah, the ghetto. Ghetto. If you hear me say the ghetto, whoo, the ghetto. That's your cue to like this video and comment, which should be on the whiteboard word of the day. Next episode. Don't forget to subscribe because we are on our way to a milli. Yes, sir. -y. Woo, 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 woo. Beep, beep, beep. Anyways, guys, today's challenge is Le'Veon Bell versus Todd Gurley. Who can get a 99-yard touchdown first? So I, yes, me. I put both Le'Veon Bell and Todd Gurley both on the Jets. Le'Veon Bell is a 90 overall and Todd Gurley is an 88 overall. I'm not sure if you guys watched my last video. Hopefully you did. What we usually do is whenever we have two running backs going at it, we only do running plays. We will only rush to see who can get a 99-yard rush first, but we're going to do it a little bit different this time. We're going to see who can get a 99-yard touchdown this time, meaning they will be doing both rushing plays and running plays. I have it set on random plays, so every single play is something random. I have no idea what it's going to be. It might be passing. It might be running. But once Todd Gurley gets his 99-yard touchdown, I'm going to switch him and Le'Veon Bell to keep everything else the same. Keep it as even as, even as possible. The number of attempts at upper left hand corner, as you can see right there. Here we go on attempt number one. Todd Gurley, everything is set to all Madden. He's not even... What the frick? So for some reason, he didn't go for his route, but attempt number one, Todd Gurley now rushing out to the left side. Follow your blocks. You've oh my gosh, we gotta get on attempt number one. Stiff arm that guy, get out of the way. Juke, ah! Todd Gurley on the RPO, taking the handoff out to the right side with no help at all. Him versus four guys, and it turned out bad, obviously. Looks like they're blitzing, but we got the RPO. Can we get outside of that blitz? Yes, sir. Nope, no sir. Down number four, Todd Gurley is supposed to go for a route there. Yes, he, he got the catch. He's got a spin move. He's going the other way now, and he didn't get it. Nope, he didn't get it. He didn't get it. Down number five, out to the left side. Todd Gurley, nobody's around him. Spin move. Okay, maybe not. Uh, maybe not. Number seven, RPO. Blitz. Todd, doesn't matter to Todd Gurley. Ugh. Attempt number eight, and look at this route. He could be going very far. He might go very short, though. Oh, he's going to go very far this play. Easy. Yeah, right. Yeah. He's broke that other guy and he's gonna miss those tackles does he have the speed can you just hold on Levy or not Levy on now Todd Gurley on a 10 number eight into the end zone he did it ladies and gentlemen boys and girls there you have it wow these defenders are from the ghetto Woo. So here we go. We had Todd Gurley going on a pretty francy, francy route right here. He has one guy on him. When he makes this cut right here is really where he got him. That guy was too far behind to catch up. Todd Gurley, open running field except for this guy. He jukes that guy who breaks that guy's ankles. His own teammate. Could you imagine that? Then it was just a whole game of cops and robbers right here. The Bengals being the cops. Todd Gurley being the robber. Robbing them of a touchdown on this player. Are you kidding me? Three guys versus one, and none of them are going to catch up. Jackson, number 22, almost caught up, but Todd Gurley got away safe, and the money is in his bank now. On attempt number eight. Okay, so it took Todd Gurley eight attempts. Le'Veon Bell is in. Everything is set the exact same way. Here we go on attempt number one, the HP slip screen. Can we get on attempt number one? Well, why does it go bad for them, both on the first play? Anyways, attempt number one. Can we get it on attempt number one with Le'Veon Bell? Out to the left side, gets a catch, breaks free from that one. Stiff arm there, he's getting out of that end zone for sure. Attempt number two, uh, HP slip screen to the right side. He gets it off this time. Attempt number two, can he break it down the field? Spin move to nobody. Wow. Attempt number three. Now look at this route. It's the same route that Todd Gurley ran. Can he get the touchdown here? Could this be the almighty route right here? He gets the catch. He's got a spin move. He's got a juke to the left. It's going to break free. Kind of not really. Dang it. Attempt number four, he's running to the left side. Going through that gap, breaking off, breaking off. Nope, not breaking off. At number five, running straight up the gut. Can this work out? Nope, it didn't work out. At number seven, Le'Veon Bell absolutely has to get on this attempt if he wants to beat Todd Gurley. 100% right here. Le'Veon Bell on this route. He's open. He's got the catch. He's not taken down. He's not going down for nobody. And he's tacking down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Attempt number eight, he can still tie it right here on this run play. Going to the outside. Getting wrapped up. Dang. Number nine, out to the left side. 
Le'Veon Bell, he's got that catch, he's got two blocks, not anymore though, and he's still gonna stand up, he's gonna hold his ground, wow! Set number 12, a toss to the right side, this could be good, he's got a block, he's got a juke, can he get down the field, can we juke this guy, can he outrun these people, nope, nope, nope. Set number 13, he's going out to the left side, he's gonna get that catch right there, he's gonna juke, and he's gonna break off two tackles, get another juke, he's Look at this route he's wearing the number 26 that's his number can we get it on his number right here let's get it Le'Veon Bell oh he gets that catch but he didn't run anywhere frick at number 27 that's my number can we get it on my number Le'Veon Bell you got a loss of yards on my number thanks at number 30 run to the left side this is it I feel good about this I feel like they're gonna blitz to the right side we're gonna run to the left this could be it this could be good this is gonna be good because look at him go look at him go stiff arm oh he went out of bounds at number 31 look at that route he is going Going. Woo -woo. Deep is what we call that one. Okay, we're gonna throw it. He's gonna get that catch. He's running. He's got the ball. A juke. Yeah. Another juke. Too many guys, but he's gonna get out of that. Are you kidding me? Attempt number 31. I think the attempt number was, but Le'Veon Bell making magic out of that play. Wow, what a magical play. That ain't the ghetto. No, no, no. He's going to the right side. And then he's gonna cut up the field. He's not really ahead of his defender by a lot, but he he manages to get that catch, breaks off of his defender. Now is where the problem comes in because Le'Veon Bell doesn't have the fastest speed in the world, but he's gonna make it work. He's gonna make that guy miss a tackle. He sees this guy, he knows he's not gonna outrun him, so he gets that juke right here. He has got that juke, he's got that juke, and now, now he's thinking, I'm screwed, you know? This game of cops and robbers is over. I'm going to jail, but... He somehow breaks off of that tackle, makes this guy just barely miss, and oh my gosh, he gets in his getaway car, and he is taken off down the highway, out of sight of these cops. They're not going to catch up to him, and he's going to take it to the bank just like that. Bada bing, bada boom. Attempt number 31, I think it was. So there you guys have it. It took Todd Gurley 8 attempts, and it took Le'Veon Bell 31 attempts. Now, I'm not saying Todd Gurley is better than Le'Veon Bell in any way at all. This is just a fun challenge that we did for fun. Thank you to whoever commented this challenge. There they are on the screen right now. If you want to see your comment on the screen, then make sure to comment down below what we should do next, guys. I had a good time making the video. Hope you did good time watching. As always, leave a like, subscribe, and comment what you should do next, guys. I'll see you in the next video, but of course, if you try to get it back-to-back, -back, can we get it back-to-back -back with Le'Veon Bell now rushing on this play? We're going to juke this guy. We got our X Factor still. We got a block. We're going to juke this guy. Oh my gosh, we might Bruh. get it back to back. He makes that guy miss. He's running down the field. He does not have the speed out run number 36, I don't think. Bruh. But he has his expectation. He's going to miss. And Le'Veon Bell is going to take it back to back. Passing and rushing. That's the first time that's ever happened. As this is new, we've only done one other video where we've done passing and rushing for these running backs. And Le'Veon Bell is now the first player in history to make a touchdown with a passing play and then back to back get it with a rushing play that was incredible three times in a row can he get it it's been done before but can he get it this is now rushing on the rpo he's got a block and no he's gonna keep on going oh my gosh Le'Veon bell he has his x factor i think that has a lot to do with it but oh my gosh three times in a row now that is another history passing rushing and then an rpo play are you kidding me he just he is setting the bar really really high four times in a row never been done before will Le'Veon bell with his x factor be the first person to get it four times in a row i this this would be so big for the channel if he gets it right here Lit, oh that doesn't count four times in a row Never been done before. Geno Atkins has his X Factor. Le'Veon Bell has his X Factor. This is crucial. This is huge. <clears throat> nope. Breaks off. He's, he's, oh my gosh. No way. No way. No way. Oh, he might not have the speed. He might not have the speed. He might not have the speed, guys. He might not have the speed. Does he have the speed? Oh my gosh. He did it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Holy crap! Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Hold on. Oh my gosh. Le'Veon Bell sets the record by doing passing, rushing, and RPO three times back to back. And he broke the record for doing it four times back to back, which has never been done before. He just broke two records.
Oh my gosh! What? This was an insane run too. I didn't think he was actually gonna get it. Breaks off that one, spins that one. He's got this gap right here, but 22 is on his tail, man. Holy crap, look how close this guy is. We were wiggling back and forth trying to create room, but this guy was not giving up. Look how close he was. Look at that. Wow, he was, oh my gosh. Five times in a row, is un it's, uh, it's unrealistic. I don't think it's possible. Five times in a row. I don't think it's I don't think it's real. I don't think it's possible. Yep. He gets brought down. Holy crap. If you stuck around and watched that. Wow. Oh my gosh. That one is for the books. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Wow. You just witnessed history. Goodbye. Holy crap.